We can see we have just two days left to do this month's fourth battle event. This is a PVE event for the Digimon Battle Bracelet Arena app that goes live like once a month. And you basically get sorted into one of three groups. And then from there, you have like the duration of the time period to uh, get as many points as possible and get as far as you can. So we got Team Digipolice, which means we're going to be fighting against, um, you know, Dark Tyranimon, which is a virus. We're going to be fighting against Cerebrusmon, which is a vaccine. We're going to be fighting on the hard level against Rust Tyranimon, which is a virus. And the ultimate level is Omegamon Zwart. That is so Here we go. cool. Looking. Fourth battle. We're locking these guys in. Let's see if we can beat the mega level holy knight with our first try here we go here we go i think we can so again this is a pve event this looks so cool right all right and so like we should be good here honestly let's go big damage That was a hard one to get. Ah. Anything 20 or higher is usually good for me. This is going to do a lot of damage. I barely know anything about Digimon. Always a Pokemon guy. I'm, I'm both. I, I've i always been both. I, I like Digimon a lot. I think I liked the Digimon show more than the Pokemon show. Big damage. And this is like a major boss battle. So like this is going to do... We're going to take a lot of damage here. Defense Arena. Oh, we got the bad roll too. Dude, never lucky. Look at this. This is going to do... We're going to take a lot of damage here. That was a bad. That was really not good. Uh, oh, that's a lot. That's a lot more than we should have taken here. All right, Alpha Mom, mess him up, buddy. Come on. Got to get those warm-up games in. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Oh, I messed up. Yeah. <laughs> All right, all right, here we go. And again, let me know how the sound is. Let me know if the sound's too loud, too soft, not loud enough. We could always change it. Boom. Okay. All right, we're doing all right. We should be able to win. Soak some damage here. There we go, big excelente. It's balanced pretty well. Thank you, thank you. So the main point is to get those excellence, mitigate as much damage as possible. The more damage you take, the more stacks you get on your W attack, which is that teammate attack that you can fire off when, while you still have both of your teammates active. So you see we should be at like a level two, I think. Maybe, yeah, it's level two right there on our W attack. We want to wait till that's like a three or a four. And then do as much damage as possible. Ah, my gosh. I messed up again. It's all right. I will say, out of all the fourth battle events, this looks to be one of the coolest bosses that we've seen so far. We fought a bunch of really cool stuff. We have. I'm going to W attack him next turn. So actually, this turn, I want to take as much damage as possible. So I'm just going to just go right there and take as much damage as possible on purpose. And then that'll hopefully get me up to a three tick on my W attack, which will let me do even more damage. Nice. Should give me a three tick. Right? Please? There we go. And they're done. We should be able to get the KO here. Look at that. Let's go. Let's go. Big damage. Cool. So we're going to take that one out and we beat the boss. To be fair, Alpha Mon is pretty cracked. Like, it's hard to get Alpha Mon in the first place. Um, it's one of those mons you have to do like the end of like two completely different dim lines to get it But we did uh, get some points And so basically the way this event works is you can play this as many times as you want practice as many times as you want and uh, Your points get added to your team's overall score and the team with like the most points near the end of the event wins We're on the digi police right now Which means we're currently on last but there are still a couple more days left of the event. So that's kind of how these things work. I think these events are great for just like practicing because you get to go through as many little mini games as you want. So if you're someone that needs to practice a little mini game part, which I definitely do, uh, these events are great. So I think I'm going to do it one more time. We're going to do it one more time. 
And what's really cool is even if you don't have access to all the dims and everything like that, you can download this app, right? And you can get the rental mons and play them like the easy and hard modes and make it easy and hard. You know, it's it's fun. You know, if, if this is something that seems fun for you, like you can you can mess with it to your heart's content. Let's lead with let's lead with King Edamon this time. <laughs> Dude, Edamon, let's go, let's go. Edamon's about to get bopped. <laughs> All right. Oh, 23 is good for me. That's a pretty good combo for me. So let's go. 74 AP. Dude, that's so nice. So this guy doesn't have like, he's not, this guy's not EV trained. He's just kind of in my app. That's pretty good damage. He's gonna take like half his health bar. Watch this. <laughs> Here we go. One, two, three. Nice. Excellent is perfect. Let's see how much damage we actually take here. Ah, it's not gonna do that much. Not gonna do that much. Right? He's so happy. That's, that's a good amount of damage taken. All right, all right. I see you, Edamon. All right, do it again. Uh, 18's hard to hit. Ah, only a 19. That's fine. Just need to see what shenanigans you're up to now. Yeah, dude, this is what I'm doing. This is what I'm doing right now. I love this. I have a channel for this stuff um, where I upload pretty consistently. And uh, I like these little end of the month fourth battle PvE events. They're a lot of fun. Even just messing around, you know, we can have a good time. What platform is this? So this is on your phone. This is all on your phone. Yep, mobile. It's called the Digimon Vital Bracelet Arena app. Oh my gosh. All right, let's fire off the W attack. Let's go. W attack time. King Edamon. We have a four charge. I got faith in you, buddy. I got faith in you, buddy. Somebody has to have faith in King Edamon. Let's go. Big damage. They look so cool, right? They look so cool. Oh my gosh, that's so much. Now, King Edamon, I'm not going to let him go down. There is another mechanic here. You can click Protect and have your teammate just take the hit. And Alphamon has a humongous health pool. So we're fine. Alphamon with the big block going for the follow me. Easy peasy. Cool. And then you're still back at King Edamon here. Let's get a big combo. Or not, you know. I'm just trying to have a good time. That's cool. 21's nice. 21 is kind of nice. 73, dude. That's so sick, man. It's a, it's a really high multiplier for like a bad mom like this. There we go. Almost. Yo, next turn. Next turn. We got him. We'll go for one more defend. Or, sorry, protect. And then can get him on to deliver the finishing blow. That's so sick. So there are two different forms of Alpha Mon. There's regular Alpha Mon, which you can see like right here, you know, but then there's also like the Super Omega Alpha Mon, which we're using right here. He's pretty nice. And th there's some players that are like so freaking good at this game. They get like 30 plus combos like every time. I just fat fingered it, but yeah. Alpha Mon's pretty nice. Much better than King Edamon, which is over here. But, like, you can't tell me he's not, like, super cool. And we're going to take those wins. So, yeah, we were able to do this fourth battle event pretty easy. I always have a good time playing these. They're a great way to get uh, ability tickets. And, uh, yeah, this is just a lot of fun. So I had a good time with this one.